From the Technodrome at Shepparton Studios, we bring you Techno Games 2002. Dougie Fast Tracks from Halifax in West Yorkshire, looking for rather better fortune now in Heat 2. Light Storm on the inside from Hornchurch in Essex. Mac 0.26 from Aberdeen in Scotland. And in the outside lane, Plastic Meltdown from Aberdeenshire as well. Team, stand by to compete. Power up. And Light Storm 2 from lane 2, a new world record 1.037. Absolutely shot away from the rest of the field. Light Storm, the fastest 1.037 world record leading the field. So Light Storm 2, actually the fastest rocket yes. car there of them yeah. all. Yes. Um, and has a new world record. But just how fast were those cars going? Give us an idea. Well, the fastest one reached a maximum speed of 153.4 miles an hour over, over 35 metres. No wonder I couldn't see it. <laughs> I was talking to them and they said uh, we must get the mass down, so we got the mass down as low as we possibly could go. In fact, they've got it so low that it's almost not a rocket car at all, it's almost just a motor with little wheels on it. But to get the mass as that low is that's how they've managed to get that very high speed. Thanks, guys. In lane one is Lightstorm from Hornchurch in Essex, won the heat in 1.03 seconds. Team Hart have gone through a process of evolution, developing four cars. Silver medalists last year but now they're back with this, Lightstorm 2. They've gone for miniaturization. They're using a micro A-rated motor that weighs in only 14 grams, but the car only weighs seven grams. Talk about power to weight ratio. If the ignition works, this thing's gonna go like stink. Blink, and you'll miss it. Alongside it is Turbo Flame from South Aberdeen, heat time 4.27. Lane 3 is Rapid Rickshaw, heat time 2.43. They come from Charlton in London. And in the outside lane is Bishop Heber Community School Cheshire's entry, Catalyst, at a heat time of 1.9. Stand by to compete. Lightstorm 2, Turbo Flame, Rapid Rickshaw, Catalyst. Lightstorm 2 from lane 1 and Rapid Rickshaw from lane 3, the two qualifiers. The time 1.48 from Lightstorm. As Simon said, if you blinked, you missed it. Look at the gap with Rapid Rickshaw finishing second and then Turbo Flame third. So to the final with doggy fast tracks drawn in lane 1. Best time of 1.61 seconds. Lane 2, the fastest in the field, 1.03, the best time of Lightstorm 2. In Lane 3, Mac 0.26, a runner-up in the semi-final, best time of 1.31 seconds. And in the outside lane, Rapid Rickshaw, his best time is 2.43, second semi-final runner-up. Power up. Lightstorm, but only just from Mac 0.26. The best race was in the final. The winning time 1.924. It was very, very close. Victory to the favourites, Lightstorm 2 by three hundredths of a second from Mac 0.26, with Doggy Fast Tracks taking the bronze. So Laurie, Peter, and Robert, congratulations. And Thanks. welcome. You are new world record holders. How does that feel? Absolutely brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> Good. I'm glad you're pleased. Because you took only four hours to build your award-winning robot, but mm. three months to design it. That's How come right. it took so long, Laurie? Well, we went through a series of uh, stages with the rocket design, from last year's silver medal car through to light lightweight designs, more and more lightweight all the time. And also, um, I found that by using lighter engines, um, they'd run the distance required, but because they're lighter engines, they're less propellant in them, the car runs faster. So we ended up to that little thing that Noel's holding. How are you going to celebrate? 
That's a good question. How are we going to celebrate? It's the most important of all of the questions I've asked you. Have you worked it out yet? Well, what, are you oh, first? <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> tonight? <laughs> you, you'll have a rocket in your pocket. That's <laughs> Thanks, Some, Noel. Someone, someone had to say. Thank you very much. But right now, anticipation.